So I've basically just spent three hours trying to get the camera thing to work and it to sync up to my phone and everything. And then I come out and it turns out my strut, my rear axle broke off. So I took off the wheel and then I discovered that the axle itself is broken, which isn't that big of a deal because it was staying on well enough for me to walk it to the bike shop. And when they took a look at it, it turns out that something on the frame broke also. What the fuck? And what's weird is that's not supposed to happen because the frame is kind of a bad thing to break. It's designed so that the derailleur would break first, which sucks, but is at least replaceable. There's a little piece of metal missing right here, which keeps the derailleur hooked on. And that's what broke instead. So I spent the last hour or so bringing this down to the bike shop, which is luckily not that far away and they could fix it. Frames usually come with a lifetime warranty though, so I could just call and get a new one. They would just send me the frame though. It would take a lot of money and time to bring the handlebars off, derailleurs, brakes, wheels, all that good stuff over. So that sucks. So I decided I was probably gonna buy a new bike anyway for the bike trip, cause this one is starting to, it's not bad, but it was just wearing out. They had some bikes I was looking at that was cheaper than this one was, and it looks like it'd be just as good. So that's a plus, but I would still have to wait until I get the money for that. The manager guy there was really cool though. I told him about the whole bike trip and everything. He thinks it's cool. He's like, dude, let me show you some of the cool bikes we have too. You know, like the $3,000, $5,000 ones. He knows I can't afford it and I wasn't going to pay for it. They have bikes with like hydraulic brakes on it. That's just crazy. There was one with a carbon fiber frame. Cannondale was the name of that bike. They were showing off a $10,000 bike and he had pictures of it. We kind of like geeked out on our bikes for a minute. I was thinking it can't possibly be sell that many $10,000 bikes and they probably just give them away to their sponsors. So uh, Cannondale, if you want to sponsor this channel, you are more than welcome to. I would just want one of those bikes. He also gave me a couple pamphlets for a couple different bike rides that are coming up this year. This one, I like this one especially, it's the Michigan ride calendar. If my bike trip turns out pretty popular, I might be doing a couple of these. There's people coming, see you later.